In this video, we're going to look at how we can see which apps are using our battery on the iPhone. If you're running low on battery, what you may want to do is see which app is using that battery. How do we do that? Let's find out. Let's go to my iPhone. If you're curious on which apps are using your battery, all you have to do is just go over to your settings app. And then if you swipe up, you're going to see battery. From here, what we're able to do is place our iPhone into low power mode. We can check our battery health. We can see what the battery level was for the last 24 hours, or we can see how it has done over the last 10 days. But below that, you're going to see we have battery usage by app. This is where I can see which apps have been using my battery. So in my case here, over the last 10 days, because I have this set for the last 10 days here, I can see that my settings app has used my battery the most. Basically 46% of the usage of my battery over the last 10 days has been with the settings app. Below that we have Safari. Safari has used 25% of my battery usage. In my case that's because I've created recordings based on these two apps so naturally they're going to use more battery power. If you want to see the activity of an app, you can also go to show activity and then you can see the activity of the app. In my case here, the settings app has spent 32 minutes on the screen, while Safari has spent 7 minutes. My home and lock screen has been 51 minutes. So we can see that the settings app here has taken more power. It spent less time on the screen, but it has taken substantially more power. We have 32 minutes here compared to 51 minutes, but when I go back over to battery usage, we have 46% compared to 21%. So the home and lock screen, even though it's been on the screen nearly twice as long, it's used half of the battery. So this is a good way of seeing which apps have used your battery. If you have an app that is always showing up at the top, what you may want to do is force quit it, see if that helps. You don't have to force quit all of your apps. Maybe there is a runaway process on that specific app so you can force quit it. You could also delete it and re-download it. That may help. Or just use it less often. So that's how you can see which apps are using most of your battery life on the iPhone. The way that we do this is we go to our settings app, we go to battery. From there you're going to see various settings, but if you scroll up, you're going to see battery usage by app. You can see this in a percentage or by time. What I would recommend is looking at it over a 10 day period, not a 24 hour period. So that's how you can see which apps are using your battery on the iPhone. 